Welcome to Preform Line Products. The following presentation illustrates the recommended hot stick application of the cushion grip suspension, or CGS. Note that this video only outlines the direct application of the CGS to the conductor. Please reference our cushion grip suspension complete standard installation video and the associated product application procedure for detailed instructions. Before installing the CGS, ensure that the conductor has been properly cleaned and the suspension's final location has been marked. Several hot stick accessories are used in order to complete installation of the cushion grip suspension. A universal ratchet wrench or universal socket wrench used to tighten the housing bolts to the appropriate torque. A universal bolt holder used to install the clevis bolt for insulator connection. A universal cotter key installer puller for installation of the cotter key into the clevis bolt. Universal pigtail tools. The tools mentioned in this video are suggestions and the hotline sticks and accessories that the installer is comfortable using and makes installation easiest are recommended. Before beginning clamp installation, loosen all bolts so that the top bolt is loose and the bottom bolts are just a few threads into their associated nuts. Ensure that the rubber grommet holding the top bolt in the CGS body is rolled back at least half of the bolt length. This will facilitate easy installation of the top bolt. Using pigtail or similar grabbing tools, lift the CGS upside down over the conductor using the working hole on the bottom of the body or one of the suspension mounting holes. Carefully position the housing so that the cushions are flush with the conductor and the bolts are parallel with the ground. Ensure that the CGS is located in its final suspension position on the conductor as lateral movement of the suspension after beginning to tighten the bolts is not possible. Begin to tighten the bolts on the body starting with the single bottom bolt and then moving on to the two top bolts. The bolts should only be tightened a few turns, allowing the clamp to freely rotate around the conductor into its final location. Pulling down on the cushion grip suspension body while the bolts are being tightened will help keep the body in line and minimize shaking, easing installation. Rotate the CGS around the conductor 180 degrees to its normal orientation, keeping the bolts parallel with the ground. Begin tightening the bolts to their final, specified torque values, keeping the housing halves parallel by tightening the bolts in a circular pattern. This pattern should be repeated several times until the proper bolt torque is achieved. Please reference the application procedure for the specified torque values for the product being installed. After reaching the specified torque on each bolt, ensure that the housing halves are parallel. If the clamp halves are not parallel, make corrections as necessary. Install the clevis pin into the suspension ears along with the appropriate hardware needed to connect to the insulator. Use the cotter key installation tool to install the cotter key. Installation of a bolt, nut, and cotter key is similar with the exception that the nut must be tightened before the cotter key is installed. Installation of the cushion grip suspension via hot stick is now complete. All safety guidelines set forth in the appropriate application procedure for this product must be reviewed and followed prior to installing this product. The installation shown is intended to illustrate the application method of the product only. It is not intended to supersede any standard utility safety guidelines and practices or use of required protective equipment.